Wolfpack, what is going on, Savage here? In today's video, we're spectating some trios, and during this trio, we're gonna be talking about how enemies should be playing and outplaying other enemies. It happens so many times this game, I really hope you guys learn something or enjoy this video. If you do, drop a sub, leave a like, but without any further ado. Guys, you know what time it is, boys? Tool time! A lot of you guys don't get that reference because I'm old as shit. But here we are today, spectating the trio of greatness. We got people honking the horn, we got people flying choppers, and this guy out here just pistol shitting the fuck out of people. I love it. I love it. Got a little bit of solo split action, though. Let's go move over to power line. Look at the incredible gameplay from your boy. Got people coming up the staircase. This is an easy hold, AK or push. There's MP40 on the ground by us, which I definitely would pick that up, but instead we're gonna turn around and watch the opposite direction. There it is, right there. Look, look, pick it up. Back and secured, boys. I love it. Now, again, we have people under us that are coming up. We saw my mini map, that's how I knew. There's two, there was two. Uh-oh, that could be a fatal mistake. What are you doing? Pop the, pop the, pop the, pop the, pop the plates. Hey, hey, there's plates? Come on, I'm gonna pop them bitches. Plate up, plate up. Well, now he's pushing, now, now it's too late. Maybe it's not too late. He's out here now. Oh! Slide cancel little skin boy. I love that shit. Nick farm the 252. What a name. Oh, Nick from the 252. My bad. Yo, what area code is 252 comments? Huh? What is that? Too lazy to look it up. We do have a team on the boat right behind your boy. And here's this dude right here spamming and praying with this fucking gun. No idea why. Look, I respect the fact they're all off by themselves. I love that shit. But guys, you got to be a little bit more aggressive and play these areas a lot more. There's a guy right in front of us. That just comes down to bad aim and accuracy. Also, if you guys struggle with ADSing and tracking the enemy, just hit fire. Hit firing is extremely underrated. I'm guilty of it myself. But it's one of the reasons we'll have good tracking. That is questionable. Pretty sure we just stepped right on that bitch. Now look, quick note for you guys that are snipers or want want you wanting to be better snipers. And this is not the building to sit on. I hate to tell you, but it's not. You want to get a little bit more aggressive with these with these snipers. You don't have to like just go super aggro and, and run around like I do, but play prison. Prison's gonna be your better one. Nova 6 is gonna be a great one as well. Control's really not that bad, but it's definitely not the preferred because, well, everything's the high ground around it up here. Um, but sitting back here all the way in the corner, you're literally, literally limiting yourself to just this area. And he got a knock on Sergio, but unfortunately no execution. Again, not surprised. Look at how much cover and concealment the enemies have. Little hesitation on that, but again, I'm okay with that. If you're trying to learn, I get it, I get it, no hate. We're in this long drawn out fight. Now I'm all for practicing. Oh, this guy's fucking dead. What? You missed that one? Also, don't be that enemy right there. Do not ever prone crawl out in the open trying to contest a sniper. Fucking ever. He held his breath way too long. He held his breath way too long and lost the ability to hold it anymore. And that's why he had so much sway. Um, As a sniper, I want to give you guys a tip. Don't ever hold your breath until you're about to fire. Track the enemy, allow the sway to happen, and right before you're about to pull the trigger, hold your breath. And when you miss, let go. Pretty sure there's an enemy next to us. I thought I heard footsteps as we fell down. I might be wrong, though. You made the top 25. Nearly there. Uh-oh. Oh, he was behind us. Hey, we knew it. Ghost coming in, killing us from behind. Falcon, no idea what the hell is going on. He's in the same boat. Just kind of sitting in one area watching one building. This is a weird vibe also. Now in his head, he's probably thinking he doesn't want to push up because he doesn't like close quarter fights. But again, this is a very vulnerable position. You have you have all these buildings behind you right now. You have bio weapons that's behind you. You have dead zone that has an angle on you. All these buildings have an angle on you. And your teammate has died over there. Very, very, very ballsy to say the least great shots with this shitty ass weapon
Now that is wall bangable. I definitely would have gone in there. I definitely would have sprayed through the wall hitting that live ping. Maybe? You know what, bro? Maybe this weapon's not that bad. Switch your gun, finish him off. Uh-oh. That's questionable. Great getaway. Stim away, played up, baby. Oh, this isn't good. Played up as you're running. Played up. This is dangerous. You hear him play Chow. He's just sitting there. We're just sitting there. This is a standoff, boys. I think he's right around the corner. He's not. Bro, it sounded like he was right on top of us when we heard him reload. That's actually wild. <laughs> I didn't hear him run away. No footsteps at all unless he deadied out of here. But I, I got to give that gun some credit, man. That really wasn't that bad of a weapon. The centering on it, bro. It always just returned to center. I love that. If anyone's got a build for that gun, man, please let me know in the comments, bro. I want to I wanna level it up and try it out. A little bit of stick drift action right there. There we go. Fixing it up and re-challenging. Here we go. Radiated sitting on the same amount of kills and power line as well, dude. We're really not doing a whole lot of anything. Again, look, winning is always the objective in BRs. Do, do not get twisted, but help help the lobby die off faster by playing. There are some sweat teams in here, though, because look at this circle for only for only eight players. This is massive. Below us, easy kill, easy kill, easy kill. Could have stayed on the you could have stayed on the high ground, homie. What did you? Falcon, homie. Hell, hey, hey, snap back. It, this this is weird. Your boy got put in timeout. I'm done, son. I am done. All right, one teammate left. Never mind. There he goes as well. Ladies and gentlemen, we're in a fucking three v three. What a what a weird match. This game is literally gonna last for eight minutes. This is actually wild. Unless they just don't fight each other for five minutes. Now, if I was the enemy team, I'd be on prison just waiting for these guys to come out. It's honestly, easy gatekeeps. Real easy gatekeeps. Just sit up here, dude, and just wait. Megan Fox doing what she does best, camping. Gotta love that shit. All right, Orange is going in by himself. This could this could be uh, scary for your boy. Let's see what happens. Got an enemy up, enemy up, and enemy further back right there. Again, I'm surprised no one's playing this, expecting the gatekeep, because right now these guys are all vulnerable. Could be an easy, easy kill if you're on this roof, but it is what it is, man. Mistakes have been made. He just zip lined to the top though, a little late. Megan Fox going down now, face in a two v two. Again, guy on the rooftop. You see him peeking, not even shooting at us at all. Great job by Tusnix. Trying to go up here. And shoot this guy in the back. Fall back, fall back, fall back. Played up. Peek it, peek it, peek it. Never mind. He just keeps spraying. Yeah, if he's spraying, don't peek it. Where's our guy? Where's our guy? Come on, Green. Where are you going? Green, he's one tap, homie. Oh, you hate to see it, dude. Now, what I was trying to say was when he was when he was plating up, you want to keep peeking, but because the enemy kept shooting, I respect him not peeking. He actually did he did really well in that fight, to be honest, especially for being stunned. I'm not mad at it at all. Seven seconds left. Very surprised both these guys don't full send the shit out this player before our team comes back. Very surprised. But it's very unfortunate for us because we're the only ones with guns left. Rotate out of here. They're in a bad spot, brother. You're in a bad spot, brother. We got the low ground. It's a 1v2. That was a very impossible fight to win.
Your boy Eok. I don't know how to pronounce that. Rocking 12 kills. Way too focused on looting right now. I get you want to get money, get your boy back. But again, dude, these guys are right above us. We could go ahead and start positioning in a better spot. Or if you really want to get him back, just take your money from your homie. I don't know what why we're wasting this time right now. It's a 2v3 and I guarantee you they're holding hands. I guarantee you. This is a questionable push. No gas mask, the cough giving us away. This is unfortunate, man. I don't see him winning this fight. I'll sleep when I'm dead. Oh my god, look at that. Good beams. You got to give him credit. But again, dude. Yep. No. Yep. 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 Duh. Pop that reload. These guys might full send. They'll be crazy if they do. One guy jumped off the roof coming in the door. This is a 1v1 potential right here. Do not allow this team to re-collapse on each other. We got to win this 1v1 fast. Otherwise, this dude's going to collapse again. And yep. Now it's a 1v2. That's unfortunate, bro. That is an unfortunate fucking mishap. Guys, you got to read the mini map. You've got to. Um, both those teams kind of played weird. They did not do what they needed to do. But right there, dude, if you're in a solo situation. You've got to pick teams apart if they split up. That team split up in, in every form or fashion. We killed the first guy. The second guy was by the window. The other one's on the roof. That was an easy kill. Or at least would have been easier than a 1v2. He overstayed his welcome. Played it too slow because of the fear. And unfortunately for him, it cost him the game. But guys, again, dude. Stop it, man.